Hi everyone, welcome to a new weekly vlog and this weekly vlog I'm starting with a little shoe haul and actually a shoe haul and a little spring prediction like a spring shoe trend prediction. You know, I'm a lover of Pinterest and one thing that I found over and over again over Pinterest for the spring summer trends 2023 were like woven shoes, like raffia shoes, woven shoes and you might have seen that last year like at the end of your last year um in the late summer collections valentino aquazura bottega venet they all brought out woven raffia shoes and i found the most amazing shoes from a brand called vivaya and for full transparency i'm working with them on this part of the video because they were so kind to let me choose two shoes that i think will be an amazing spring trend and obviously i chose two raffia shoes and let let me unbox them with you so first of all well the first one i already unboxed them and then i remembered oh, i need to wait for you to see it so let me just first open the ones that i did not unbox yet and that's the beautiful i mean look how beautiful this box is and also vivaya they are an amazing brand if you saw my last video that i did about them they print their shoes in like 3d printers and they make them out of plastic water bottles like they are recycled out of plastic water bottles and i mean that's insane that's insane and they are so comfortable the last pair of shoes that i bought from them let me just show them to you real quickly Those are the first pair that I bought last year and they are so comfortable. They are so comfortable. So I'm super excited for the new ones. And that's how it looks when you open it. Beautiful with the packaging and oh, do you see them? I chose, like the first pair that I chose, were those beautiful woven pointed toe ballerinas because I hate round toe shoes because I think of round toe shoes, it just, it's not flattering. Let's put it that way. Round toe shoes are not flattering. And also pointed shoes are all over. Like they were all over the runways for the spring, summer, 2023 season. And look at them now. Beautiful raffia looking material. I mean, you can bend them. Perfect shoes for driving, perfect. And here at the, do you see that here? At the end, there is a little cushion because if you get blisters, super easily i mean i do with those you you won't you won't because they're just oh they're so comfortable and also here it's like a little cushion if you go to the website you will see how great this technology is because they do different um they do different different like parts on top of each other so that it's breathable and that it's comfortable and also you can put them in the washing machine so yeah I mean, it's sponsored, but you know that I would never, ever, ever accept something sponsored if I wouldn't buy it myself. And those shoes are just very, very pretty and they fit like a glove. Um, I usually have a 38 and a half, but with flats like that, I usually take a 39 and in those I took a 39 as well, like in those two. And in the other ones, I took a 39 as well. And the second pair, they are gorgeous. I mean, I think, let me just show them to you. Let me show them to you. Again, the packaging and then, oh, they are again in this raffia-like material, but wait until you see the front. It's be happy. I mean, how cute are those shoes? Yes, they are round toes, but I mean, they are more like the loafer part. And also, I think they are great shoes for walking around at home, like great home shoes because my shoes that I wear at home I don't like ugly slippers I like real shoes that just are very comfortable and that you can wear around your house and you know me I never wear like um, joggers or something like that so my house shoes are also they should look kind of normal like they should look like normal shoes but feel like house shoes and since I made um, the experience that Revive shoes are so comfortable, I thought, well, those could be my little house shoes. And then when I look down, then I'm just happy, like you be, be happy. And yeah, they just make me smile. 
whilst running around the house. And look how gorgeous those are as well. Again, very, very, very pretty. And yeah, I mean, I mean, I'll just leave them on because um, I'm at home and those are my house shoes. So very happy with my two purchases. And yeah, oh, those are even made with hemp. That's interesting. That's interesting. And yeah, really like them. I have the links down below. I put a discount code here because you get 10% off if you use my discount code. So if you want to buy something, then hurry buy it um, because I might I have the suspicion that they will sell out real quickly because as I said Rafia shoes are it for me at the moment so yeah now um now I'm showing you the shoes now I'm just going to work a little bit more and then let's see where do where I will take you and also this week I have some very fun things to do I have brunch with a friend. I have a little photo shooting because a friend of mine has a clothing brand and she asked me to be in the pictures for the website because they're just at the beginning. Um, I'm doing that and yeah that's what I'm doing. I hope you enjoy watching this weekly vlog and I will see you very soon. Hello everyone. So I'm just now dressed in my new shirt cashmere sweater white pants and my curls like my heatless curls in i'm just stressed i'm going to go to the city for a little bit and then i have a shooting because a friend of mine has a, cl a clothing company and she needs a model for today that's me and yes that's what i'm doing today and actually i have to tell you i already put the clip out but i wanted to show you because i usually drive like that most times when I go to places where I need my hair to look good, I put in my heatless curls and then drive with them. And then when I'm there, you can see I only did the front parts today because the back parts, they already looked good. Wait a moment. And then the back. The back I didn't do with the heatless curls because they already, I did them with the air wrap. But then look at that. How good does that look? Now they drop a little bit, that's perfect. They will drop a little bit, but they still, they do look very good. Like I think my hair looks extremely good. And yeah, I'm doing it now. And actually after being a little bit in the city, before going to the shooting, I will do it again whilst driving to the shooting because then I am there my hair is already done and they don't have to do anything to my hair. And yes, that's it. Maybe a little bit too much Tom Ford highlighter on my top lip, but now it's good. I actually was sick the last couple of days. Now I feel a little bit better, but now I'm eating brunch, but I don't even know what to eat for brunch because I already feel a little bit sick in my stomach because it's not 100% good. So I don't know what I'm going to eat. It's something very, very easy, di easily digestible with a tea, something like that. But I will try to remember to vlog it for you what i'm taking and yeah now i'm going maybe pop into zara because i'm half an hour early like i'm deliberately half an hour early because i wanted to pop into zara and yes that's that's what i'm doing now so i will see you later and it's a sunny day so it's time for the sunglasses to go in and i actually most of the times I only wear sunglasses because I think they look good on my head and I don't even wear them down. But yeah, we're already unbuckled, but now let's go. Hello all of you, so now I've been back from doing my nails and look, I think they look amazing. They're not comparable to how they were looking and also I did my feet as well. So for all, for all the food lovers out there, and I know you are there, you can, you now have some free goodies. Uh, I think she did an amazing job because yes, I did not show you how my feet were looking before but 
they were not looking great and now i think i think she did an amazing job and also the nails look at them together i always do pink on my hands red on my feet now enough with the foot content but if you want to know the colors this one is opi Bub bubble bath and the red one wait a moment i have to look it up i, I wrote it down wait a moment i found it and the red one is called frill of brazil so bubble bath here frill of brazil down there and it's they are the opi gel colors and i actually think the opi gel colors are probably one of my favorites opi and also cnd shellac they and oh it's not gel it's shellac in europe we mostly always do shellac and not gel it's better for the nails so they are don't they don't get so much destroyed and i also think like acrylic nails aren't really a thing here they really are not a thing like shellac or normal nail polish and i hate normal nail polish because i'm a bit clumsy with my nails let's put it that way and normal nail polish just fades away um like in a day i have cracks in a day so i would have to do it every single day and this if it's made very well it lasts me a month and on my toes to be honest it lasts me like two months maybe even more so yeah also my toenails they don't really grow that fast so that's why they, it lasts me so so long but yeah that's it but i also i would actually really really like to try the manicurist i think they're called because they have such better ingredients in the nail polish and i would really like to try it and also they have an at home kit which i would really like to try out but um yeah i need to look into it a little bit more